All right, here we go into set number two on mines. PvP super friends leading one set to zero against the immortals and taking a quick look at the tank setup. Quite varying tank selections coming out from both these teams right now. PvP going with only two heavy IS-3s, one medium, and two AMX 13s. They love to go this setup. It gives them a lot of mobility, a lot of different things they can do with this tank setup. And yeah, there we go. Robin moving over to that western island. And Batman gonna initially probably move out to the eastern uh, village area and then join Robin in that kind of a western push. And on the immortal side, uh, a much, much heavier tank setup. We went five heavy tanks. Yes, indeed. So, uh, well, yeah, sorry about that, folks. We had some uh, technical difficulties with our microphones. So here I am, I'm back. And uh, well, sure enough, PP Super Friends starting up north. Yeah. Uh, and that's definitely going to give them the advantage. Oh, yeah. And there we go. Robin easily taking out that T1 right now. Um, the teams that actually defeated, the team that defeated uh, PvP on this map is they sent a heavy, uh, it was either a T6 down or a heavy tank. To, to the that, West Isle. Yeah. No. And then actually, you know, they could actually uh, hold their own against Batman or Robin. That would be inevitably be over there. Yeah. Nullifying that flanking yeah. maneuver. Yeah. I think that's the only way to uh, counteract this move and the spread uh, by uh, PvP. Actually, just a T1 going down. Dustin Lupong uh, taken out as well. So we're dead even on that front. He was taken out to the Eastern Village. Oh, wow. Uh, okay. So, uh, yeah, just uh, pretty even on that one. And it was. Uh, uh, Kitan with his AMX 5100 uh, that got that kill. Yep. So on the immortal side, they also have an AMX back near their base area. Oh, Ooh, and a nice a little shot. Little mech, yeah, just taking plenty of damage courtesy of the Sirius here. Yeah. It's got to watch out. Yeah, he was just being a little too cocky with uh, with this uh, Hilltop move. Just yeah. Just progressing uh, a little too much sell than he should have. Yeah, the key to the strategy coming out from PvP is that though that those frontline tanks, they cannot go down. They have to stand there for as long as possible, take as much damage and you know deal damage if they can, but really this all comes down to Batman and Robin slowly picking away at the Immortal's health and eventually allowing PvP to, to uh, actually push in. Exactly, just surround them. And uh, although, yeah, most of the time they do uh, lose one or two tanks, uh, usually the damage uh, uh, dealt by Batman and Robin just too significant if Little Mac and Anuto can actually stand their ground yeah, exactly. uh, until they manage to make that flank. I mean, look at that, like such a huge, huge presence of uh, heavy tanks like those IS-3s and T-32s. Uh, you got Iron Boss, PNL, and the Sirius all squatting, and they're actually pushing right now. Yeah, so Robin did manage to get a shot onto Iron Buzz. It didn't do any damage, but it did damage his track. So Iron Buzz is going to be, you know, maneuvering, maneuvering a little bit slower. It's not going to be too crucial, though, right now. And yeah, uh, a little Look at man. that, Anuto here trying to get a shot, but oh, they're just like right now, I, I'm actually liking what the Immortals are trying yeah. to do. They're trying to, to flank their enemies, like uh, using that... Uh, uh, right path to that hilltop. Yeah, and they're actually gonna be also undercover from that western isle as well. Yep. So I really yep. like that move, yeah, from coming out from the immortals right it's now. It's very smart, and they're actually oh just my God, really they're forcing. In. They're forcing PP on the defensive. Yeah. Anuto is probably gonna go down. And on they sent their amnesty over to the western isle, so just so that Batman and Robin can't come here to support this. Anuto is really low. Anuto is definitely gonna do, go down. Look yeah, at that. Yeah. He's just way alone out there. Uh, he's he's definitely gonna go down in this one. Iron Boss probably gonna finish him off here. Or yeah. PNL maybe. He has to yeah, do as much. Oh, he did a little bit of damage before he went down, but it's not worth it. Oh, Little Mac He's taking so a lot of damage as well. As so well. you know what? We might actually just see uh, um, PvP this time around lose the set. Yeah, they managed Batman and Robin down at the Western Isle, down way south. They managed to take out Savage over there in the AMX 50. Uh, 50. Yeah. Little Mac's going to go down, so I, that trade is not completely worth it. I mean, Batman and Robin, they got to, I don't know, it's gonna be extremely hard for them to actually come, you know, to try to take this out unless Ace Wood can take out Katan. If they can uh, finish off Katan, then they can actually. Uh, Maybe come back they can this. pull this off, but uh, in terms of uh, of like just the tanks that are left, uh, the Immortals have such an advantage, a huge uh -oh. advantage, because it's just they're so much more like heavily armored. Uh, so. Yeah. And like it's gonna be up to Ice Water to prevent oh. this big base capture. He managed to take out Katan right there. The base capture has been solved on both sides, but definitely a yeah. Huge but look at advantage. that Ice Water is just almost down here. Yeah. It's just, uh, I mean, yeah, he's probably gonna be able to uh, fend off this capture long enough for Batman and Robin to come back, but that's just gonna be it. Yeah, I don't know if he get, if he gets one more shot off. Oh no, no, it was delayed as well. So. Yeah, exactly. Because you know the yeah. series came back to defend this. I mean, the Immortals are gonna take the set. Yeah. And and, and actually, like you know, it's I think it's completely deserved. Yeah, uh, the way that they played this, 
is absolutely brilliant uh, as well. So, uh, yeah, you've got Batman and Ice Water remaining, and uh, that's pretty much it. Yep. And honestly, I really don't think they can pull this off. I mean, unless, like, a miracle just comes through. Yeah, it's going to be extremely hard. Exactly. Yeah. 94, Only 95, 96. Seconds. Like, yeah, that's just going to be Oh, he okay. delayed it, He delayed it. Okay, he, delayed he delayed it. it. But, and uh, right now, Batman is coming back. So if they can, I don't no, know, he's just in 10 seconds, he actually might, he, he can get a shot off right now. He can get a shot off right now, but can he take care of two tanks? Maybe not. Probably not, but oh my god. He does get a shot, but... If Batman pulls this off, like, honestly, <laughs> I mean, although I... You he know, might Bat be the greatest player we've ever seen, Batman, ever. <laughs> Batman is my favorite superhero to start yeah. with, but if Batman can actually pull this off, which I really don't think he can... Yeah. No, it, that's, this is going to be extremely difficult to actually pull I off. I mean, unless, because, okay, one shot on PNL would be enough to take him down, but still, he would still face Iron Buzz, who's got an ice tree, yeah. um, and who's virtually, like, on scat right mm -hmm. now. So, uh, as much as I do uh, like the 1390, he just doesn't have the firepower to pull this off. Yeah, I don't. I don't. Think he simply so. doesn't. Yeah. Oh, he, he. Ooh, did he get that shot off? I don't know if he yeah, actually no, hit him. Yeah, no, he actually just uh, he he damaged like uh, I think uh, PNL's or was it Iron Boss track? I'm not quite sure about that one. Mm -hmm. But like, yeah, he's just uh, gonna oh, have Batman to find a better in. angle. Yeah. Oh my God. It's like so close to being capped right now. He's gonna actually go for like a close quarter combat shot. Oh, you, I don't know why they're not actually pointing their turrets towards Batman right now. He might get PNL right here. Oh, no. It actually.